Welcome back to another Untrained video. In today's video, we will go on a Vanilla Plus survival server on Russia, where basically it is a normal server. No kits, no max skills, no high times loot, just normal survival. In the last video, I managed to get a good solo Rex Riches, get a nice base down, and get some really good loot. If you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more Russia Vanilla videos in the future, make sure to drop a like, let's aim for 500 likes. Also, subscribe to not miss any future videos. In the last video, I announced a mythical giveaway, and this is the winner. If you're watching and you want to claim a prize, please join my Discord over discord.gg slash ldg and contact me over there. Today, we're going through another one, which is a Steampunk Hammer Strike Zobek. To win this mythical, make sure that you have liked, subscribed, and comment something below. And if you are a channel member, you also have a hard chance of winning. Also, I have a 10 mythical giveaway link in the description below so if you want to win a free mythical make sure to check it out and let's get straight into the video before we dive into the video i want to introduce you to today's sponsor are you guys trying to start your own unturned server whether you want to play some survival roleplay or you just want to play with your friends then look no further than pine hosting pine hosting makes setting up your server very easy they offer high performance servers and the interface is very user friendly and super easy to learn when i first started hosting my own network i had no idea how to do anything but with pine hosting's navigation i did learn the basics in a very short time they have locations scattered across the world and the pricing is also very cheap pine hosting also caters to a lot of different games that include includes Rust, Arc, and Minecraft. A standout feature is the ability to install plugins and mods just by clicking once. If you already have another server with another provider, you don't have to worry because Pine Hosting will help you move your server seamlessly. If you're ready to start your own unturned server, don't miss the link in the description below and be sure to use the code LDG for a huge 30% discount and let's get straight into the video. Alright, so this is where I want to build there's uh, a lot of shots going on, damn. Zubek, Yuri, Eagle. I killed him! Bro, Bulldog at far range is not a good idea. Hit him again. Alright, he's dead. I'm bleeding out. Let's med up. There's people here. Hit him. That guy has a jackhammer! That guy is running away. This dude's dead. What did he have? He didn't have guns. He had a pickaxe, though. There's a dude back here. What's up, man? Hit him. De oh, he has a Vaughn, yo. He's dead. And I started building the external room that I was talking about for the loot room. Alright, so I just got myself a sniper scare. We're gonna ditch the Hawk Hound. Getting ourselves some pretty good loot. We got ourselves a second blowtorch. My teammate got a jackhammer. There was a boy here that just died, and we just found his loot pile. I'll take the sniper scare. Definitely an upgrade from a Hawk Hound, man. Especially on a server that's vanilla. I also got myself low t low caliber ranger, so we can use that for my empty Zubak in base. So that's that's pretty nice as well. It's starting to get dark, so we're gonna hit up Zavod. We're gonna see what's up with Zavod, and then we're just gonna probably home. Wait for it to be day. I'm not a fan of PvP in the nights. Especially when we have no night visions. Right, so my teammates actually killed the guy with the Zubak. So that's pretty nice. Yeah, they gave me high caliber ranger too. So that's nice. I'm probably gonna go depot. Alright, so we're over at military. And funny thing is we actually have just found ourselves a helicopter that just spawned. So we locked it. We're filling it up with fuel. And I think we're gonna, we're gonna take it to our base. It's gonna be so good for us to move around, man. So running around with Zubak finally. Hopefully I don't die instantly with it now. Oh, never mind. I'm dead. I've been in the military for like 10 minutes and somebody just showed up out of nowhere. Probably has a sky base above. On the server there's always a sky base above military, man. No way, I just died. As soon as we found the heli and I lost the only zoo back that we have. Alright, we're back. My teammate's pushing him, I think. Yeah, he's dead. Bro, this is terrible, man. And we also have ourselves a, a locked Anushka. These things both just spawned right now, but the Anushka's kind of stuck. Yeah, we have another Zubek here. I think my teammates depoted, actually. We have no scope for it. Let's just get ourselves a med kit. Bro, we lose now. We literally lose so much progression. Because we had some good loot on us. Now we're back. I don't know if that guy is solo either. I really hope he is. And my teammate is going for him. What? Where did he go? Oh, he's on... Of course he's on the tower camping. And there's two guys, one with Fury and the Zub. Yeah, my teammate is dead, man. Yeah, speaking in game, they know where the Goss can. I don't think we're gonna survive this, man. Yeah, all of us are here. If we get to kill them, though, we would actually profit so much. You get so much loot. My teammate, what? He's going for. He's trying to escape with the heli. He's trying to shoot. Ah, and he's gonna blow up. Yep. And there goes our heli, man. There is no way. We could try to get the Anushka, to be honest, but we just need the car jack. So for now, we'll probably just leave it there. Yeah, they're trying to bait us out. They're trying to shoot us, scare us. We could try to go around, maybe. 
I don't really know how we're gonna do that. Let's kill the zombies. Yeah, they're throwing grenades at us. Yeah, so two of my teammates, one has a sniper scare, the other has a hawk hound, and I have a zoo back. I don't know how we're gonna do this. And yeah, my teammate, he actually ran for it. I could TP to him and try to go them around, try to flank them. Yeah, they're hitting my teammate's legs. Oh, he hit him, I think. Yeah, I'm just naked with a zoo back. Oh, they have an AUG, bro, as well. And there's a plane coming. T oh my god, there's no way. Oh yeah, so I'm, I TP to my teammate. I'm gonna try to flank around. I hope that I don't die now. I need to try to get to the other side. Let's kill these zombies. My guy throw a smoke somewhere. Yeah, let's try to run around. Oh yeah, we made it. I don't know where they are though. Oh. Okay, I died when I was in, man. There is no way, bro. Okay, so I think my teammate killed one of them. We got a Yuri. I really want to get the Zubaks back, bro. That's all I want. My teammates apparently killed the AUG guy, though, so... They should probably depot it in base. Yourselves a military shirt. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know where the loot is. Oh, there's a dude in here. And he's dead. Yeah, he's not one of them. He had nothing. He had a Yuri. It's not bad. Military clothes, military vests. Oh, my guy is up on the tower again, bro. I don't know how he keeps getting there. They definitely have to have a sky base up there. They're just jumping off. That's so OP, man. We don't even know that they're coming down. And they know where we would be. I don't know if we should try to push. I really don't know what we should try to do. Oh, there's a guy down there. And there's a guy... Oh, he's dead. Let's kill the zombie, man. I don't know if the guy above is dead, because there was somebody else shooting at him with Zubek. Bro, we really don't belong here, man, with these Yuri's and Snapers Chaos. There's no way we're gonna profit. I'm gonna try to push up. Completely silent. And hope that the guy up there is dead and we'll get their loot. That's l literally all I have to do right now. Alright, we jumped off. Uh, there's loot over here. Anything good? Raw, Snapers Chaos. There's that boy there. I have a plan. These guys are literally right behind this wall. I'm gonna build up. Yeah, they're killing... I think they're killing zombies right now. But there's multiple people. There's definitely two for sure. Yeah, he's right over there. I saw him. I need another plate. They're medding. I'm not gonna expect this. Yeah, one dude. Two dudes. Oh my god, I killed them both. Nitrate, Yuri. Two Zubaks with a drum. All right. We just profited heavily from this. Yeah, I'm gonna home. I'm gonna get out. I can't home right now. I literally just got so much good gu guns. My teammates also depoted an AUG and a Zub. So, from two Zubs, we just got all of this. That's actually insane profit. They did not expect that, bro. 3,000 IQ tactic right there. Alright, so I made myself a few lockers. Gonna depot the guns in the lockers, obviously. I'm really happy with that double kill, man. Alright, so with all that metal, I'm actually gonna make a few more lockers. We should be able to... Yep, another locker. Let's put it on top of this one. My teammate is still a military, by the way. I'm gonna TP to him in just a sec. And maybe we'll get ourselves even more loot. That would be insane if we do. Oh, there's people coming, man. It's a duo. This is terrible. I'm here with the Yuri and I'm out in the open. I have a plan, though. I'm gonna try to wait for them to pause by and then I'll try to backstab. This is the only way I could kill them. They seem like they have... Like Zubax or Nitraders or something. Yep, they're right behind this. Yeah, they don't know about me. Oh, this is perfect. Yeah, they're clueless. One guy dead. Oh, dead. Oh, Zubak fully decked out. Another fully decked out Zub. <laughs> Bro, there's no way I did this again. I'm getting out of here, man. That plane is passing by. He's gonna... If he jumps off, he's coming for me. 100%. Yeah, he did jump off. One dude jumped off. Oh, he jumped up. Oh, my teammate is here. I, I homed. Hopefully my teammate doesn't die, actually. But I had I had to leave, man. Two fully decked zoobs with drums, fully attached. Military helmet and the vest. It's very nice to have, you know? Yeah, we're starting to get quite loaded now. That's very nice to see. So I think next what we're gonna try to do is we're gonna try to calm down a bit from military PvP. 
we did get what we need, which is high tier PvP guns. I do think if we stay there, we would uh, keep killing them and they would actually try to target us. So that's not good. And they, if they find our base, it's very easy to raid right now. It's not really anything that strong. So what we're going to try to do is I'm just going to try to get ourselves some loot from around this side of the map. Gauss Musk would be perfect right now as well. There's a dude on the car. <laughs> He's dead. I don't think he had anything though. Yeah, my guy was just. I'm gonna die. No, I'm dead. Bro, I got trapped by zombies. No way. <laughs> Alright, boys. So I got some good news. First of all, we got ourselves a gas mask. So I'm gonna do a solo run in the dead zone. Now, some other good news is that it's a full moon. So I'm actually gonna take an extra filter that we have. First of all, we're gonna have to run over there. But I'm gonna take an extra filter that I have and I'm just gonna spend as much time as possible killing zombies. So that way I would actually get much more loot. If zombies respawn, the XP is gonna be crazy as well since it's, it's a full moon. They're gonna be like double XP and they're military. Now, let's just, honestly, let's just hope that nobody's gonna be there. That's really the only thing. And hopefully I don't die to like stupid stuff because that would suck. But I'm gonna run over there. My teammate is gonna help me get over there. Hopefully I don't die on the way. And then we'll get ourselves the gas mask and the filter from home. And then I'll do a full moon over there or until the filters run out. We're gonna have the gas mask and an extra filter. So from there, I'm just gonna hope, honestly, for either a detonator or a dragon fang or a mega zombie. That would be honestly perfect. We're gonna try to get as much guns as possible. Raw explosives, grenades. Obviously, if we get elite specs, then it would be great. If we get an echo, that would be also pretty good. Attachments, you know, hopefully we get ourselves good stuff. High caliber ammo. We already have a high caliber ranger ammo in our base. So if we get more and an echo, then we could also actually start doing some raids. Alright, so we have made it. There are zombies outside, so that's a good sign. Let's just hope we get good loot, man. On Vanilla, a dead zone run is crucial. Well, first item, we got a helmet. We're gonna get so much XP from this as well. Zoo back, good. Perfect. Already a good start. Yeah, the zombie didn't drop anything. Military knife. Shirt. Come on, man. You gotta give me the good loot, though. You can't give me shirts. All right, we got a grenade. Yeah, let's just stay in here. Wait for zombies to come up. Uh, we got ourselves raw. It's pretty nice. Zombie right over there. Uh, pants. Nothing really good. I mean, it's good for meds, but it's not what we need, bro. And yeah, there's nothing in this room. Alright, usually the good loot is at the bottom, and that's where the mega zombie spawns, but... Yeah, there's no mega zombies. Uh, Night Karev. Zombie just respawned. Shirt. Grenade. Come on, man. Give me the good stuff. Nothing here. Amari. Amaris are nice as well. For vanilla, it's actually good. Drew dropped nothing. Oh, there's gonna be a spitzer. Um, okay, this is terrible. Let's reload. Let's kill this dude. Let's kill the spitzer. Yep, he's dead. It's like just clothes, man. These zombies didn't really drop anything good. Let's wait for this stuff to go away. Accidentally salvaged the helmet. I should not have done that. If we die, a helmet would be a good thing to have. Alright, there's a bunch of attachments. Almost died. Actually, no, that's a Yuri Mag. I thought it was a barrel. It's med up. Another MRE. Let's check out this room. Oh, Echo Mag. Alright, that's not bad. It's a clove car. We don't need that. We didn't really get anything good, man. Right, let's check out inside this building. Pants. Nice. I guess we got good XP, though. We got ourselves a Mag. A beret. Let's take that Mag for sure. A Bulldog. I could take that. This dude dropped nothing. Check out in here. There's nothing, though. Let's get this dude. Scope. 7x. Very nice. Claymore. Okay. Another mag. Let's pop the second filter. For one filter, we did get some good loot. So let's just keep killing a few zombies. Another raw. There's nothing there. Now let's go down once again. Maybe loot respawned. Or the mega zombie spawned. That's really what I'm hoping for, to be honest. Yeah, zombies did respawn. Alright, let's kill him. Get ourselves a sight. There's a grenade. We can actually make C4, to be honest. We do have everything we need. I don't think we have glue, though. But that's very easy to get. Alright, a lot of zombies have respawned. Let's kill them all. He didn't drop anything, man. I'm stuck. Alright, we're bleeding, so that's just med up. Nothing in this room. Let's kill this spitter. Dead. Let's go. I don't think a mega zombie has respawned, though. Or else it would have actually tried to attack us, probably. Let's kill the zombie. Another dude there. We're gonna have to switch to Zubak. Bulldog Mag. And a tank trap. We've got ourselves a vertical grip. Another MRE. Oh my god, we're almost dead, actually. Oh, at least back. That's nice. Oh, and a detonator! Oh my god. Okay, yeah, we can get out of here. That's literally all I need. 
Okay, yeah, this this was a very good run on vanilla, man. At least back and detonator right next to each other. Bro, that's perfect. There's a dude in there. Hit him. And he is dead. Alright. Lovely. We're currently looking for a glow, me and my teammate. We've been a duel for a while. Um, my teammate's gonna go a bit AFK, so in the meantime, I'm actually gonna craft C4. And then when he's back, we'll hit up some base raids. We do know of a few raids around our base, mostly their wood, but I think that would be good raids. At least we would raid something, you know? Alright, so I've been farming a little bit, and we're working a bit on the second floor. Nothing too crazy, just for us to have, like, another entrance. I think my teammate came back, yeah. I also crafted 3c4, which is more than enough for now, especially since we're gonna raid wooden bases. Got ourselves another wood metal pillar. Going full metal, man. But yeah, we did that room that I wanted to do it full metal. Oh, my guy got on me a nail gun. Let's go. Insane load. Alright, we got ourselves c4. On a 2x2 two two wood. I don't know if it's good, but there's only one way to find out. So let's see what we get from 1c4. And looks like nothing that good. I got that nitrator for my teammate because I was running around with a, a bow. Not really that good, man. Straight kind of sucks. Got a lot of metal from it. Uh, a lot of food. But this raid is definitely not profit. There's a dude there. Hit him a few times. He's dead, alright. Check out if he had anything good. Kill my teammate. He had a fully decked out Snape Herskia. Alright, second base raid. There's a wardrobe back there, so let's hope we get good something, man. And okay, well, uh, lockers, but <laughs> there's nothing good in that wardrobe. All right, this is not good, man. All right, let's put another charge, our last charge, and all right, there's loot. Oh, oh, okay. You know what? That's really good. Uh, like five filters, raw, uh, aug, it's a bunch of guns. You know what? That's not that bad. We got ourselves a bunch of raw, too. Yuri, master key. You know what? I would say that's worth it. Those filters, we can get so much loot from them. It's literally a different dead zone run each time. And if one of them just has a mega zombie, perfect loot, man. They could drop dragon fangs and that kind of stuff. So I wouldn't really complain with that second raid. First raid was ass. First raid was very, very bad. But this one, not that bad. Alright everybody, that is where we're going to conclude uh, this two-part series. I really hope that you guys enjoyed. If you guys did watch both of them and you guys had a good time, thank you so much. Also, a huge shout out to my teammates for playing with me, Sonic Brads, and a little bit of Waffle. Played for like 30 minutes, but still he did help out. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed and I will see you in the next one. Bye.